If you are unable to run Remnant 2 because you get the error, DirectX 12 is not supported on your system. This usually happens because you're not running the latest Windows version, outdated drivers, and problems with DirectX agility, so follow the steps of this video to learn how to resolve this annoying error. In the first solution we'll update your graphics card drivers to the latest version. First open your start menu and type device manager. Open your device manager. Expand display adapters. Right click your display adapter. Select properties. Go to the driver tab. Click on update driver. Click on search automatically for driver software. Wait for the update to be installed. You can also click on search for updated drivers on Windows Update. First Google GeForce Experience. Click on GeForce Experience. Press download now. Save the file. Run the file. Press yes. Now install the program. If you already have GeForce Experience installed, open GeForce Experience. Click on Drivers. Press check for updates. Press download. Wait for the latest drivers to be downloaded. Select if you want an express or custom installation. This will install the drivers for your video card model. Now wait for the drivers to be installed. Restart after it finishes. In the next solution we'll add a line of code to your shortcut to bypass the error. First right click your Remnant 2 shortcut. Select Properties. Locate the target section. At the end of this line press the spacebar once and add the following line of code. Press Apply and then OK. Now launch your game. First right click your remnant shortcut. Select properties. Select the compatibility tab. Check run this program in compatibility mode. Select Windows 8. Now press apply then OK. Now launch the game.
In the next solution, we'll update Windows 11 or Windows 10 to the latest version without losing personal files or without having to reinstall your programs or games. First, open the link that you'll find in the description of this video. Go to create Windows 11 installation media and press download now. Save the file. Double click the file you just downloaded. Press yes. Press accept. Select your language in addition. Press Next. Select ISO file. Press Next. Save it as Windows 11. Wait for the file to be downloaded. Press Finish. Double click the Windows 11 ISO file. Click on Setup. Press Yes. Press Next. Press Accept. Select Keep Personal Files. If you want to do a clean install click on change what to keep. Press next. Wait for the update to be installed. If this tutorial helped you. Don't forget to like and subscribe thanks for watching.